my hair's still wet, but that's okay. I got a light plan today. Um, going to clean up around here, wait for my hair to dry, and I'm going to do another vlog. I'm going to go out, got to get some food, got to get some groceries, some stuff for here. Should be an interesting day. I'm going to take this thing back out on the road today. Maybe show you around. We'll see. So back out on the road. Uh, today I figured, you know, I'd kind of show everybody around, kind of like the area that I live in. I did that a little bit last time, but not quite the depth of things. I figured today, um, I mean, I got to go out. I got to get some stuff for myself. I got to get some food for my apartment. Um, and you know, other than that, I don't really have a whole lot going on. So, I guess the point of this vlog is just kind of like show you around a little bit. I'm um, gonna drive kinda out of town. Um, eh, I mean, we could stay in my hometown, but there's less to look at there, and I don't really do much there anyway. Um, we might circle back around before it's all over with. Who knows? I don't really, uh, I was into, like, I cleaned my apartment today, so I kind of like dwindled down my day lot. So, eh, eh, eh see but I mean we'll get a lot of road view going on just some stuff along the way I mean uh, it, it's more of like a hard to explain really I don't want to call this the countryside but it's kind of the countryside of things there's not a whole lot out here um, but yeah we'll just take it out on the road and do a little bit of stuff here and there probably get some weird looks again I'm used to it we'll get all that going though and uh, who knows, maybe we'll see something cool. And I'm also gonna grab some food. I am, I'm starving. Like uh, I haven't ate anything yet today. All I've done is like I've woke up, I've cleaned a lot. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna grab a bite to eat too. It's gonna be a fun day, maybe, hopefully. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Also, you know, I might end up getting in on a little rant or something along the way. Nothing wrong with a little ranting here and there. Oop, that is not the right side of the road. Also, again, probably going to get a lot of weird looks. I don't really care. See some people out here fishing today. Which is weird because, like, I don't know if you can see that. It's like 50 degrees out here. But hey, you know, whatever. You gotta fish when you gotta fish, I guess. That person's walking. They probably don't want to be filmed. Water is hot, though. We've had a lot of rain here lately. Like, it's a really, really rainy season. I probably can't tell that much. There's a bridge coming up. Oh, yeah. going on between Chick-fil-A and Popeyes. I'm not going to get both today. Maybe not. And um, who knows? Um, I'm kind of thinking about getting Popeyes. Try out their spicy chicken sandwich. I've never tried it, so I might like it. Maybe. We'll see. Well, I picked up some groceries. I still got another stop. Still didn't get food, but I know where I'm going to go. Chick-fil-A. Eventually, when I get over there, yeah, that's what I'm gonna have. Mm. Still tempted to drop the Popeyes too. Maybe, I'm a little late on that one, but we'll see. Like I said, I still got a couple more stops I'm gonna drive through town. There's a cop right there and I'm filming on the road, so I'm gonna go. Well, finally got the Chick-fil-A. Fun. honestly, it was like super packed. It's like super, super packed today and I don't really know why. Somebody said it was because it's February 29th. I don't know if that's like a thing for people to just like randomly want to get out of the house. But I don't know. I'm going to find a spot to kind of chow down on. Um, 
Still got that other stop I really need to make here. And I wanted to do a quick little drive through of the this little part of town that I really like. I don't really visit it enough, but I'll, uh, I'll get a little bit of that here in a little bit. So this is the side of town I really like. Um, I really don't get out to this portion much, honestly. There's just a lot of, it's kind of the industrial side of town, but also there's just like, I don't know. There's just like an old school feel to it. Um, a lot of the places actually around here close down a lot. Uh, kind of just happens with uh, towns that don't really upgrade, I suppose. Which, I mean, in a way is kind of sad, but I, I get it at the same time. Like, this building here, I'm pretty sure has been closed down my entire life. I, I don't even know what this place was. Um, but yeah. I mean, it, it has a nice little nostalgic feel to it. I really like it. Um, kind of close to downtown. Not quite downtown, like downtown's over there. Um, but, I mean, it, it's a pretty nice little thing. I really should probably get out here more often gotten a lot of weird looks today but it's okay that's kind of toward downtown I might actually drive out that way maybe who knows this is another place right here it's pretty much been closed down my entire life I don't even know what it was bait shop that's closing down it's kind of sad it happens though like I said you know that kind of thing yeah, you know what? I think I will take a quick trip uh, toward downtown. Maybe. Traffic's been horrible today, so everything's moving like really, really, really slow. Uh, now this is downtown. Train tracks, my car. <laughs> and this is a place I really don't get out that often too. I really enjoy it here. There's a lot of cool stores. It's mostly pawn shops and restaurants and bars though. Boy Scouts. Eh, it's kind of a cool thing though. I mean, you don't really see most towns actually keep their downtown areas alive as much as you do here. I think that person almost ran a red lot. Um, but I mean, it's still really nice out here. It's cool to see everybody actually get out today too, even if it's a random February 29th thing. I, don't, I still don't really get that, but I mean, apparently that's a thing. Maybe you just don't stay at home on this day. I don't really know. But I've got uh, one other stuff I'm going to do. I, I'm, I'm going to go to Popeye's. I've already decided on it. I thought about doing a tasting with tombles today with it, but I mean, two sandwiches, it seems like it'd be a super short video, so I'll just pop it into this one. So I'm going to run over to Popeye's grab that spicy chicken sandwich and then I'm going to make my other stop right before I go home. That person did run a red lot. Whew. Dangerous out here today. Anyway, gonna get this over with and um, what in the world? Anyway, I'm gonna, oh shit. There's a oh, train coming. <laughs> ah! Ah! It, a little over dramatic. There was a train coming though. <laughs> uh, it was moving really slow, so don't worry. Uh, my life was not in danger. At least I uh, hope not, and I don't think so. <laughs> okay, more to come. <laughs> I'm actually ready to really get in on this rivalry. I had a nice little train view, the train that almost killed me. The railroad, <laughs> railroad track. I can't even talk, I'm so hungry. Is right over there but i'm ready to get in on this settle the old uh i feel like it's an age-old question at this point i'm really late at getting into this both of these are still really hot just picked them up got chick-fil-a got Popeyes. both of them spicy chicken sandwiches let's see if i can prop this thing up just right i would do this in segments but i really don't want to take too much longer and i've had chick-fil-a before so i'm gonna start off with chick-fil-a one thing i gotta already say though check that out like that meat goes over the bun the cool thing about chick-fil-a too is like they actually like they'll walk out there to you so you don't really gotta wait in line like i did over at papa's i'm actually in a different parking lot of another restaurant that isn't papa's and it's not chick-fil-a it just it felt weird to do it in their parking lot so i went to another parking lot here we go chick-fil-a big buck
may start mouth fires. It's really good. I've had this before. This is what I'm really excited about. I think it's cool too how they both, like in the in the spirit of the rivalry, they both kind of have like the same bag. Only this one doesn't say it's spicy, but I'm sure it is. Yeah, they put a random pickle on there. Oh wow, this bun is shiny, like it glistens. It feels a lot more solid. Man, this actually looks really, really good. I'm gonna just kind of like poke this pickle back a little bit. I didn't have a pick on the other one, so I don't want to like saturate it. But here we go, Popeyes. Let's see which one's better. Hmm. 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 Okay. They taste completely different, I can say that. Like, I'm giving Chick-fil-A, like I'll give it a score. Chick-fil-A, that's like, I mean, that's a good, solid, nice chicken sandwich. I mean, it's Chick-fil-A, if you've had Chick-fil-A, it has a little kick to it. So, let's see, Chick-fil-A, I'd give it like, as far as chicken sandwiches go, I would say like, a good 7.8. I mean, it's a really good, solid chicken sandwich. I mean, it's fast food. That's a good score for fast food. But I gotta say, Papa's. I know they're a fried chicken place. And I know Chick-fil-A is as well. Chick-fil-A is kind of like a... I don't know how to put this. Chick-fil-A is a good fried chicken, right? Sorry, I'm gonna roll down the window. It's getting a little hot in here. Really good fried chicken. Like I said, um yeah 7.8 it's crispy i actually got it first and had to drive to a different part of town almost died to get here and uh i mean it's really good papa's though i don't i don't know how they make their chicken and i know they're a fried chicken place they're straight 8.1 that's a good chicken sandwich i, I never thought i would like it more than chick-fil-a and I, this is the first time i've ever had papa's and I like it better. I, it, it tastes kind of like maybe they use like a buttermilk mix, maybe. It, it's a little, I don't want to say it's more crispy because it's not, it's about the same. I mean, Chick-fil-A might be a little bit more crispy, but the flavor at Papa's, wow. I, I think that Papa's might not even be as spicy either. So there is that, and I'm a big chili fan. So, you know, I really like my spicy foods, but I don't know, there's more of a flavor at Papa's, maybe a little less spice, a little less crunch, but more of a chicken flavor and more of like an extra seasoning flavor with it. I'm gonna finish like half of these, like half of each. I'm gonna get my girlfriend the charm later. Um, let's see what she thinks. What do you think? Get it, get it in the comment section. Do you like Papa's better? You like Chick-fil-A better? Do you not have either one of them in your town? You should go to a different town, try them out. I had to get in on the dispute. I mean, it's kind of late, but I enjoyed it. But I got one more stop to make. I'm going to wrap this up. I'm going to talk to my girlfriend. She might want to get in on this. Maybe we'll see what her opinion is. I won't even tell her what I thought. We'll see what her opinion is first. And then uh, we'll go from there. Probably wrap this up for the evening. But yeah, still a little bit more to go. Okay, I'm back home. Uh, picked up Stacy. We've got our Well, uh, as you know earlier, I said I was only gonna eat half the sandwiches I was gonna go pick up Stacy Bring her back here and we're gonna see her opinion. She doesn't even know what I said She hasn't seen the video. She doesn't know what I chose And she doesn't know the scores that I gave him as far as the points go. So we're gonna see what her opinion is on these We still got half the sandwiches which uh, Right off the bat you can tell like um, No, I ate half I said I was going to. I was hungry. Um, anyway, also though, um, Stacy is basically in the same boat as me. Never had Papa's chicken. Only she's not really much Chick Fil A either, so it's gonna be really different. You ready? Yeah. Okay. Which one are you gonna do first? Uh, Chick Fil A. Uh, if, yeah. Is that Chick Fil A? That's Chick Fil A. Oh, Chick Fil A first. It's hot. I guess because it's hot. Yeah. 
smell the pickle. Yeah, it's a fun fact about Chick-fil-A, like their chicken patties are marinated in chicken overnight before they're ever breaded or anything, so. And pickles? Yeah, mm. pickle juice. Okay, what do you think? It's really good. Mm. It's definitely very pickly. It's not very spicy though. Okay, you wanna try the other one? Mm -hmm. What do you give it as a score? Mm. Well, it was reheated, so it's not completely accurate, but. That's true, it was definitely reheated. Mm -hmm. Like, it's been like three and a half hours since I did this, so. <laughs> Benefit of the doubt, since it is reheated, I'm gonna give it like a 6.7. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is Popeye. Yeah. It's a big pickle, and it's got sauce on it. Okay, I wanna get a pickle bites. Okay. Crunchy. Listen, crunchy. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Give it another bite. I don't like it. <laughs> no, that's like a three. What? Like seven. <laughs> oh man, you should have had them fresh. Mm hmm But yeah. Chick-fil-A much better. <laughs> I'm still not gonna tell her what I chose. <laughs> Based on your reaction, I think I know. Do you? <laughs> anyway, you heard it from her. You heard my score. I still wanna hear what everybody else has to say and she's digging back into Chick-fil-A. Um, <laughs> anyway, again, you know what I said? You heard my score. Um, it was really fun today. Um, it was a nice little vlog, a little adventure. Uh, a defaut death is a wild day. She doesn't know about that either. Um, anyway, um, I think that's the best time to go ahead and call it here. It's very late. Uh, kids are in bed. She's eating more Chick Fil A. Um, I really like pickles. <laughs> she likes pickles. Anyway, um, this was fun, and uh, I'm not gonna do another tasting with tumbles like I said earlier. It, it seemed like a little, just a really short one to do like two chicken sandwiches and a whole tasting video. So I figured I'd do a vlog and a tasting with Tombles. This is gonna go in the vlog section because this was more of a vlog than it was an actual tasting with Tombles session, which we're gonna try to do one next weekend. Um, one I've talked about for a little bit with uh, the Japanese snack food taste test. So you can look forward to that. And again, tell me what you thought about your chicken sandwiches down in the comment section. Be sure to like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And uh, hopefully you can catch me next time. And for everybody that likes the live streams, I'll be back Sunday night, or tomorrow night, uh, doing the live streams on uh, some video games and stuff. But, you know, I'm going to keep doing these maybe every weekend, maybe just every other weekend. We'll see how it goes. Uh, but thank you for watching. Till next time, I'm out of here. Bye. <laughs> see ya. Thanks for watching. <laughs>